Okay, guys, we're going to kind of have a field trip around the site here and just kind of show you guys what we saw while we were out with the telescopic camera and kind of just pick up on some things that are there uh, through some zooming. Now, some of this imagery is going to be sped up um, just in, in order to kind of, because some of the stuff is kind of tedious, but we're going to speed it up. And not only is it going to enhance uh, what's going on there, but I think you guys get a better understanding of, of really what's involved with the process uh, to free the dolly and to get this shipping channel opened up here in Baltimore. First thing we want to stop and look at is the Cashman Dredge. And I know we just did a video on this, but what I've done here is I want to take this clip and we're going to speed it up. And I want to do that to kind of show you guys the amount of weight that this, this dredge is picking up. Now, what we're going to see here is when they go down and, and clamp onto some of the weight, you're going to actually see this dredge and the, the whole barge dip as it reaches down and picks up these huge pieces of debris. And you're going to see the whole barge shift back and forth against the, the spuds that are holding that barge in place. That is some incredible weight that, that that piece of equipment is picking up with that 60-yard uh, clamshell bucket. Now here we're, we're on the dolly, and on the other side of this crane, uh, the crews are up, and they're pulling the containers off the ship. And now what we're going to see here are the guys who are actually up on the stack, and they're rigging these containers to come down with the crane. In the port, the system would kind of be there or this process would have kind of been done with an automated system that would uh, kind of go down and clamp around the top of the entire container and lift it up but of course here that system is not available so these guys are having to do this manually they lower the crane down and this is like old school just like ships would have been loaded so many years ago before this system of intermodal transport for container boxes kind of evolved each individual piece would have been had to have been rigged and picked up and placed into the ship and then the process would be reversed once they got to where they were it's kind of kind of that same kind of system is is kind of operational here today with the rigging of these these containers to get them off the ship there's just no other way to do it and it takes a little bit of time but you can see the barge kind of moving into position below and these these boxes or uh, containers are going to come off and they're going to set these down onto the barge. The barges will be then transported back over to port where they can be unloaded and transported. But it is, it's, it's, just, it's a process to get, them, get it, all this stuff moved, guys. And that's, that's just, uh, unfortunately, it's tedious work, it's demanding work, and it is dangerous work. It's got to be done. And this is the Resolve team that is working to uh, lighten the dolly to get ready to move her uh, once she is freed from the entrapment of what once was the Francis Scott Key Bridge. Now, up on the bridge of the dolly, we could see some crew members up there, and it looks like they were uh, checking uh, some of the equipment that was up on top of the bridge. At one point, it looks like we're going to see them go over and kind of straighten um, the, the flag insignia that's flying on the ship. And this, we've seen a couple images of these guys through the windows of the bridge. This is the first time we've, I've seen them really out on the ship. I thought you guys might enjoy seeing, seeing the crew uh, there. And again, they're doing daily tasks and uh, things that they would normally be doing at any other time while this process is going, monitoring the systems of the ship, uh, keeping an eye on everything there. And uh, they're waiting for, uh, for the ship to be freed where it can be taken, um, taken away from the, those pier systems and the rest of that debris. But yeah, it looks like we got a couple, couple of the Dolly crew They're on the bridge.
And I think these guys are being well taken care of. Of course, the ship would have been provisioned to get underway and head to sea. Uh, but I'm sure if there's anything that they need uh, that's available to them while they are, while they are monitoring and, and waiting to be freed from, from what's left of the Francis Scott Key Bridge there at the site. Now, this next image is um, guys, and they are torching part of that bridge system that is still on that pier. And we're going to get in here kind of tight, but I wanted to show you guys the height of the boom on this crane and try to understand just where they are. If you don't think these guys aren't out earning a paycheck you can see that torch firing up and you understand where they are. Now they're being suspended by a basket off that crane. And this is a pretty, uh, a pretty high area where they're working. We're going to speed this up too and show you guys them kind of moving around and get in here a little bit tighter so you guys can see them. Yeah, there's a basket. And you see that torch work that's going on. And as if they weren't high enough, they're going to go on up to the top of it. It's an ongoing process, guys, and there's a lot going on out here at one time. And that's kind of what I wanted to share with you guys here. There's a lot of different moving pieces and parts uh, as part of this salvage operation and I hope this video kind of shows you a little bit about what's going on and we may do this again I'll be looking in the comments to see if you guys enjoyed this kind of video that kind of bounces around the job site a little bit and uh, kind of shows you different things that are going on in one video well hey thanks for joining us guys we're going to ask if you haven't done it yet you'll click on that subscribe link leave us some comments but most of all you guys be safe out there.